Hi everyone and welcome back to Helling Hanjo HD and today we have day number 15, one mile end. Um, this is from the New England Pale Ale Company. So we've uh, done, I think it was a couple of days ago, we've done a beer review on those guys. So I'm looking forward to this one. I think I think I just scored them pretty good. Um, I can't remember exactly what I gave them but um, yeah. I think it was alright. There is no um, description here, just a sort of interesting abstract uh, image, sort of description type of thing, but there's not, there's not any uh, big spiel that we usually have. This is 4.9%. Uh, um, it's, it's a pale ale, so we don't sort of know what we're getting with this, but we'll uh, just pour it in. You know, have a see. I always think it's really interesting when I do these beer reviews. It's like, who's actually watching them? Sometimes I get like four rev four views. Sometimes I get twenty. Do I have like this crazy loyal fan base, or is it just all random people looking for if this beer is any good? I don't know. We've got a big uh, big head here, so we'll just let that settle for a minute. Yes, I am wearing my. Uh, trusty Udi again um, it's very cold I mean it's not as cold as what it was like a few weeks ago like like when I first wore my Udi that was a crazy heat uh, crazy cold sorry so but it's not too bad this time I just wanted to wear it because it's you know it's comfortable and I'm comfortable in my own flat as it were anyway mm, this is interesting this is Kind of similar, I mean, fruity ales and fruity beers and all that sort of stuff are, is very similar to how we're, uh, you know, what we're used to, but we're just going to give this a try and uh, see what we, see what we rate it. The head's quite, pretty big, um, it's quite normal. That's lovely, that's really nice actually. I'll give it a second pour and then I'm going to give you a more sort of in-depth review. It's similar to a few, uh, similar to actually the, the New England um, drink I did earlier in the uh, in the review. It's very refreshing, it's not too hoppy, it's a little bit on the citrus side but it's not sort of like pushing me over the edge of a really horrible aftertaste, it's sort of like it sits with me and then maybe I can sit with it for a moment and maybe have something to eat and then go back to it. It's sort of giving me like a really nice vibe. So for that, I'm going to give that a, an 8 out of 10. Uh, it's not perfect, but it's it's really nice and I could enjoy that with a, a few friends. So uh, cheers guys and I'll see you tomorrow for the next one. Thank you.